U.S. Senate candidate Katie Britt in Huntsville for a few days. She toured the North Alabama Home Building Academy with program administrators today, and News 19's Kayla Smith was there. Students here at the Academy learn practical skills like carpentry and construction safety. Katie Britt says as a senator, she would support programs like this and the industries they feed. Uh, it's an industry-based model for training, uh, and so we hope that she can help us replicate this across the state and across the nation. She gets it. She understands the need uh, for a shortage of labor force in our industry. Britt says she believes in a hands-off relationship between government and business. Instead, she says she favors supporting programs that offer skilled-based workforce training. Being a partner to something like this is critically important to our continued success and to giving people a path way for opportunity. Britt, the former president and CEO of Alabama's Business Council, has received endorsements from business organizations like the Home Builders Association of Alabama. I, I think Ms. Britt fits the bill f for corporate Alabama's ideal of a senator, and that is you work you work quietly and you keep yourself positioned where you can work with Democrats, Republicans, and liberals, conservatives, and and so forth. According to a Federal Election Commission report, the Brit campaign has also received contributions from pro-business political action committees, including the National Association of Manufacturers and the National Automobile Dealers Association. With 90 days left in her primary campaign, Katie Britt will continue her tour of Alabama. The primary election will take place on May 24th. Reporting in Huntsville, Kayla Smith, News 19. And for more information about the upcoming primaries and voter registration, just go to WHNT.com.